Hello and how's it going, you awesome possums? It's been a while, huh? So I took a short break at- Short break? Try four months, you lazy f- Okay, I know, I know that's not really the shortest of breaks, but hear me out here for a sec. So I took a short break and I got into a bit of a slump in this RPG we all play called Life. One thing led to another, yada yada yada, so yeah, it's been a crazy and rough couple of months for me. It got so crazy I even resubscribed to World of Warcraft after so many years. Then in just a few hours I realized I did not want to play World of Warcraft, not even one bit. So yeah, that's $15 I'm not getting back. Anywho, before I get completely sidetracked, I think this is a good opportunity to do a video on what Planetside 2 is like for a returning player. By the way, the last time I played Planetside 2 was back in November, that's when the whole Ultimate Empire showdown was going on. So without going over any tweets or game updates or patch notes or checking the subreddit, I jumped straight into the action faster than Game of Thrones messed up its final season. <laughs> and after just about 4 months, I haven't been shot at, haven't been revived, ran over by a friendly vehicle, fallen off a cliff or committed any war crimes. I once again set my boots on the war-torn soil of Araxis. And my good god, let me tell you this, my beloved brothers in Elrond. My return to Planetside 2 experience was absolutely the same. Alright, hold on, I meant that in a good way, sort of. You see, my dear friends with or without facial hair, if there's one thing most Planetside 2 players, if not all players at least, love about Planetside 2, it's the chaos. The chaotic fights, the madness, the thrill of getting shot at from all directions, and all that jazz. After all, I believe the chaos is the game's best selling point anyway. So when I hop back in after 120 days, despite the several updates between then and now, Planetside 2 is essentially the same game I enjoyed and left a couple of months back. I mean yes, I still play like an absolute cabbage, but I still had fun. And I still did not care if I get 50 kills and die 100 times in just a couple of hours. As chill as this sounds, Planetside 2 is still pretty damn fun. I could also say the same even if I haven't played the game in years, because that was exactly the case just before I started this YouTube channel. Now when you say it's the same old Planetside 2 game after taking a break, I suppose it's a double-edged sword of sorts because on the negative side of things, it's still the same old Planetside 2 game. But you have to take the game's age into consideration. This is a 10 year old game. If this game was a dog, it will be a senior and it would get discounts in movie theaters. I'm not sure why I brought dogs into this or why they would get discounts in movie theaters but you probably get the point. Anyway, since we're in the topic of dogs, I don't really believe in the phrase you can't teach old dogs new tricks, I'm gonna use it anyway to make a point. My dear oh dear planetmen under the rule of our supreme overlord Nicolas Cage, unless we get a Planetside 3, a new game or at least an overhaul, our Planetside 2 is as good as it gets. I think. Sure, there were some well accepted updates such as the Arsenal update which was really a good one and there's the capture the flag mechanic and the class abilities, those are nice additions. And of course there are some unpopular ones like Mr. Osher, I'm looking at you. But at the end of the day, these new tricks did not exactly do much for the old Planetside 2 dog. Again, don't get me wrong, I absolutely love that we're still getting updates. I just don't expect them to be crazy game changing or anything. As a matter of fact, I'm really looking forward to the construction update. I mean, I don't do construction myself, but I certainly love a good base. So for the construction boys or girls out there, know this, your construction work is very much appreciated. I feel like these guys don't get enough love. Also, I want the tandem equipment to happen so bad just for the hell of it. I mean, look at this. Now, I could go on, but this is the gist of it and I don't want to make this more boring than it already is. So yeah, Planetside 2 is like that comforting hot bowl of soup our mom makes that we're all familiar with and keep coming back for more from time to time. Or, I don't know, maybe it's a slice of your family's pie. So go ahead, enjoy your family's pie. And I will see you in the next one. Stay awesome, possum.